Hey, I am back from a long weekend. There was a wedding and went to a church in another state than the one I live in, and I'm gonna not ramble about that before this becomes a long vlog. On Friday, 1,346 on NaNoWriMo, which at the end of that day, I was like, that's the best I've done this NaNoWriMo, and forgot that I also wrote 1,600 earlier and in the week, and the first day I wrote 1,500. If 1,300 was my best, that was pretty bad. It, luckily, it wasn't. It still was pretty good for the time, though. Then 94 on a script that day, 33 on a song or a poem. Not sure which yet. 1,473 for Friday. I just skimmed through Friday because I honestly don't remember what happened that day. So Saturday, which was the day of the wedding and we left in early afternoon, my good, good at writing part of the day. So I only got 525 for NaNoWriMo. 32 on a song and 39 on two poems. Those the last ones, the song and the poems, were while we were gone. So I didn't write on NaNoWriMo that day after we left, but I don't care. 596 total for Saturday. Bring my weekly word counts to, for just NaNoWriMo, 8,000. And for everything else, 498. I don't think I have to add those together. Um, 8,000 looks like a really good word count to me, so it's hard not to be excited, but then there's this other voice in my head that goes, ahem, that's actually bad for being NaNoWriMo, and the other part of my head goes, I don't care, just let me be happy for a minute, will you? Not that I argue with myself inside my head or anything, that would be weird. And I'm starting this week off for 228 on NaNoWriMo and 86 on a file. The outline, finally. Well, sort of. I got stuck while I was writing the scene because I wasn't sure what, where I need to place each scene. Like, um, they had these two story arcs that are going on simultaneously between two different groups of characters that are far off. And I needed, I wasn't sure where to be placing all of these, if there's need to be time skips in what the order of everything so I started writing just that those two timelines which I figured out and I never even got to the point where one of those story arcs started so it ended up not being any help because I didn't write enough of it down and it was only for one character arc or for one part of one so it's like the most useless outline ever now on Monday because I didn't record yesterday Coming back from a long weekend on Monday, I always feel so tired, like nothing's happening, so that's what I was convinced was going to happen, nothing. But, 44 on two poems, actually wrote poems on Twitter, 38 on a song, I hope to finish, but maybe not, and 1,924 for NaNoWriMo, that's what happened, boom! Bringing my word count to 2,006 for one day, which is pretty good. Even for a NaNoWriMo day, because that's ahead of the NaNoWriMo goal, which I'm going to have to do, because I've gotten so far behind. You know, not that far behind, you know, just behind. But, you know, some days I write like a tortoise, some days I write like a hare. Yesterday I wrote like a hare, today I'm writing like a tortoise. And you know the important part is? I'm writing. Which I should probably be getting back to right now. Like, right now. So, how was your weekend? That's the long mine. This is peace, love, pink, signing out.